Hello, my beautiful Libras, and welcome to your general reading. Today, we're going to see what is coming towards you, family, lover, friend, or foe. Please remember the energies in the readings can go vice versa. Okay, so only take what resonates. Feel free to switch agendas, switch the roles, do what you got to do, and leave the rest. Um, if no, I forgot what I was going to say on my gosh, Libra. So you could be quite absent minded, maybe have a lot on your mind. Um, if any of you would like to book a personal reading to purchase anything, um, or to make a donation to the channel, all info on how to do so is in the description box below, okay? And please remember the energies can go vice versa in the readings, okay? So feel free to switch the genders, switch the roles, do what you got to do and leave the rest. So, my beautiful Libras. So, your, um, your career reading was, like, really good, okay? So, let's see what is coming towards you in general, okay? Um, so, we have an apology that wanted to fly all the way out, okay? And we have happy ever after. Beautiful energy, Libras. Okay, I feel like we're on, like, a winning streak or something, okay? You have happy ever after in your, um... Money, career reading, so you may want to watch that, okay? But apology and happy ever after. So I feel like someone's going to apologize to you, Libra, okay? That's really sweet, okay? I'm smiling because I feel like it's going to make you really happy. Maybe this is an apology that you have um, been waiting for. I'm getting it's like a sincere apology, okay? It could be from a multitude of different people, okay, that you could be hearing from. It could be a love interest. It could be a... um a friend, a family member, okay, but I'm getting that, yeah, underneath that, we have celebration, so I'm getting, I'm just getting that someone is going to apologize, maybe somebody, you know, with the happy ever after, this could have been someone who you saw happy ever after with, but maybe um, something didn't go to plan, or somebody may want to make your dreams come true, somebody may do something as a form of, of an apology, like, form of an apology but how can i say this someone may um there may be something that you always wanted and someone's gonna do that for you as a means of saying sorry if that makes sense okay but happy ever after an apology is the overall energy this could be you also apologizing to someone libra but i doubt it okay just saying you know what i mean but an apology and happy ever after okay so yeah i feel like you're getting everything that you want so your money was looking fabulous i feel like your general life is looking fabulous too maybe that's what it is maybe it's just that apology you know that um because yeah your last i think your last love reading i named it i'm sorry so um it could be that same person or the same reading or the same reading it could be the same energy okay i'm sorry guys i'm kind of like all over the place i'm thinking about a lot of different things i think that's why okay so you could be thinking about a lot of different things too but happy ever after an apology okay see my eye so it's always like just in my eye like what's going on darling so somebody could be crying okay okay <laughs> Sorry, Libras. Okay, let's just get on with the reading, darling. Let's get on with the reading. All right, so what is coming towards you, darling? Okay, so we have the half up, half down. It says, as above, so below, opposites attract, and best of both worlds. Okay, so this is like my Wheel of Fortune card. At the bottom of the deck, we have the bubbles, which says, innocent, sweetness, and delight. Okay, yeah, I feel like something delightful is about to happen to you, Libra. Okay, I feel like you're on the top of the wheel right now. Things are going in your favor. Okay. Um, I'm also getting something about your innocence is being cleared. So maybe somebody didn't think that you were innocent in a situation, but someone sees you as innocent, sweet, and adorable. Labor. It's like, yes, that's me, darling. That is me. Okay. But opposites attract. So this could be something to do with an Aries or someone who's very like just opposite than you in every way. Maybe that's what they, maybe that is why this person wants to apologize because I feel like there's differences between you and somebody, but it could be misconstrued just because you handle certain things a certain type of way and they do. And I don't know what's going on here, darling, but whatever's happening, I feel like you're on top of the wheel. And I feel like somebody, whoever wants to give the apology is at the bottom. And I feel like they want to they wanna be where you are, Libra. They want to be where you are, darling. Maybe you forgiving someone um, changes their fortune in some type of way because you are karma okay 
but you're getting the best of both worlds yeah an apology and happy ever after so i feel like you know you i feel like you are the best of both worlds libra you're both justice and beauty okay fairness and balance ying to the young Awa. <laughs> okay libra let's let's see where this is going darling I see where this is going, darling. Oh my goodness, I'm excited, Libra. I'm excited, Libra. I'm excited, Libra. Okay, so what do we have, darling? We have the tribal. It says tradition, ceremony, and culture. Okay, and at the bottom of the deck, we have the pineapple. Standing out, inspiration, and individuality, darling. So you're standing out, you're shining. This could be an Aquarius. I wanted to apologize to you also. Okay, you could be very inspired. I feel like somebody's very inspired by your culture. I'm getting something about your hair. I'm hearing something about wear your hair up, or maybe half up, half down. Okay, someone likes it when your hair is up. Or um, you putting your hair up brings a lot more ideas, okay? Or if you want to grow your hair, I'm hearing to keep it up. Somebody may actually have like a pineapple style. I thought that will really suit you, Libra, okay? But I feel like you have a lot going on when it comes to your mind or your thought process, okay? There's something very unique and different about you, okay? Uh, with the culture, ceremony, and tradition, yeah, I feel like something about your traditional values, your morals, something is keeping you intact here, okay? So yeah, because I feel like you have strong morals, but somebody else doesn't, or... I just feel like you're balanced, Lee. Well, of course you are balanced. Sorry, my head is itching me. Of course you are balanced. Okay, it's like really greasy, so you know. Um, you are balanced. I feel like someone needs your energy in their life. It's like, you know, everybody needs the labor. Everybody needs the balance, darling. Everyone needs balance, darling. Everybody needs the scales, darling. People are like they don't need us, but they need us, Libras. <laughs> Okay. Now, somebody may want to apologize to you for saying something about your culture, where you come from. Okay. But I'm getting something like ritualistic here. Maybe you're doing some type of ritual. You could be cleansing yourself, cleansing your energy, cleansing your aura. So it's raising the vibration of you, but not only you, but those around you, as above, so below, darling. Okay. Or maybe somebody looks at you as an inspiration. They want to be like you. Just like, you know what? I want to be like the Libra. I want whatever whatever energy Libra's on, I want to be on that. Okay. But an apology is the overall energy. So somebody's apologizing for maybe somebody disrespected your culture where you come from. Okay. You know what I mean? Someone could have said something. Just like, okay, you know what? Now somebody wants to apologize to you, okay? This could be some type of ceremony that you're having. This could be like a wedding. Yeah, because underneath that, we have celebration. Then we have spiritual practitioners. So some of you could be spiritual practitioners. But I'm getting some type of celebratory energy here, okay? I'm also getting as well that you are honoring your ancestors, your culture, your spirit guides. And I feel like your culture looks amazing on you, Libra. Okay, it looks amazing on you. And I know that sounds ridiculous to say, but we're living in a world where people are always trying to culturally, cultural, cultural appropriation culturally appropriate other people's cultures you're like you know what i'm where i'm from i'm a north i'm look good so i'm not trying to look like any other culture and any other bitch darling okay <laughs> i'm in like a fantab fantabulous mood okay i'm just making up my own words and shit so you could be feeling in a fantabulous mood too i'm just thinking like what decks do i want to use yes lose yes let's use this one please clarify the half up half down i just want to do like a little quick reading for you guys because your your money reading was long okay so we have all oh, the rich bitch just as i said that so i'm getting long money honey okay but yes and then we have the activist okay so definitely something to do with your culture to do with your rights maybe you're advocating for something or for someone okay or you're believing in yourself you want social change i feel like you're inspiring a lot of people around you libra okay so yeah i'm hearing no if there's no justice then there's no peace so it's almost like you know i also hear like where's my money darling i feel like somebody's gonna pay you or you're gonna get some type of compensation maybe you've been um discriminated against okay and you figured this out like hold on how come all the black people get paid this and all the white people get paid this and all the mexicans get paid this and like what's really going on what's really going on <laughs> you know what i mean but I'm, I'm getting like your money is, is looking absolutely gorgeous, darling. Somebody wants to apologize. Maybe somebody wants to give you something or pay for something. Somebody also could have been fighting against you. Maybe someone doesn't understand you or your culture or where you come from. Someone just doesn't understand you, darling. So that's why they want to apologize. Because I think that someone thought you was fighting against them. But you're just like, no, this is just 
I'm just very passionate about my beliefs. You know, it's not personal. It's passion. It's not personal. It's passion. It's okay. <laughs> but with the rich bitch, clarified by the half, half, half up, half down, fortune is in your favor, darling. Okay? Beautiful energy. Beautiful. I also feel like someone really sees the value in you, your culture, your beliefs, your traditions, whatever it is that you're doing. You also could be starting your own tradition. I'm getting like real re revolutionary vibes. I feel like you're starting a revolution, Libra. Okay? I feel like you are. Honestly. You are an inspiration to people. You're helping to raise humanity. So keep doing what you're doing, Libra. Whatever it is you're doing, Libra. Keep doing what you're doing, Libra. I'm also getting that someone can't say your name enough. So people could be saying your name all the time, like Libra, Libra, Libra. You're like, yes. Okay. <laughs> and then we have the drama queen. Yeah, I'm feeling really dramatic. <laughs> you have the drama queen at the bottom of the deck. So somebody may want to apologize for causing drama in your life. Okay. I also feel like, you know, when you're not around, there's this drama, Libras. Everything is just all over the place. My energy is needed. Okay. All right, let's see where this is going, darling. I feel really cheeky, okay, so. <laughs> My beautiful Libra is, darling. Um, temperance, yeah. Balance, darling. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius. You could have significant Sagittarius placements. You're an angelic being that is here to restore balance, beauty, and serve karma to those who deserve. Okay. So I'm just getting peace is, um, how can I say, surrounding you, being bestowed upon you. Also, somebody's coming in to apologize to make peace. Yeah, because somebody's really dramatic. It's almost like someone trying to act like you're the dramatic one. It's like, bitch, I'm the Libra, not the Aries. I'm not the warmonger. You know what I mean? That's not my energy. This could also represent like a reconciliation as well. But your angel is around around you to bring you something that they feel like you deserve because you are of value. I'm also getting the prices going up, Libra. So you could be selling something. You're just like, you know what? It was £20 yesterday. Well, it's £50 today. Okay. Period. That's what your angels could be instructing you to do. Honestly. But I'm getting like lady luck with these two vibes. Okay. But this is really beautiful. Also, something about perfect time in here. I feel like you're like an angel that comes into someone's life to just, you know what I mean? Or somebody could be waiting for the perfect time to kind of like say something to you or apologize to you or give you something. Okay. Yeah, the fool. Take that leap, darling. Take that risk. Take that leap of faith. Okay. <laughs> Honestly, you're so cheeky, Libra. So cheeky. Why are you so cheeky, Libra? Like so cheeky. Okay, what's coming towards you, Libra? Come on, Libra, come on. Okay, it's taking a long time to like fly out, darling. There we go, darling. Okay, oh, we have the King of Pentacles. I can't even speak properly today. Okay. I'm hearing is it because I'm handsome and wealthy. Somebody's coming with them coins, darling. Like I said, some of you could be um getting some type of compensation. Maybe you've been fighting against something. There's something going on with your finances here. But something is coming in abundance because something is owed to you. Now, you could be um, you could be starting some type of group or something. Some type of cultural group and somebody wants to invest in this. Like somebody sees that you are a, a great investment. Whatever it is that you're fighting against, someone's like, you know what? I want to support this. Okay, how much do I pay? Or maybe you're trying to raise some money or get some type of donations or a fundraiser or something. Someone's like, okay, darling. You know? Or this is you just feeling very secure and very stable. Okay. This could also be something to do with your husband as well. Someone you're married to. It could be a Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo. You could have significant placements. Okay. And something about your roots. Because this is on the top of the... This is on top of the tribal card. So you're rooted and grounded in something. You're just like, this is who I am. This is how the fuck I do it. And this is, what it's, this is what's going to happen. This is how it's going to be. It is what it is. It was what it was. And it will be what it will be. And someone's like, okay, where do I invest? Thank you. Now we're talking. Also, if somebody wants to apologize to you, do you know what? You know... It's called taking account ability. 
So how about you drop those O's in the apology? Like, how about you, we, we, we get rid of the rest of the letters and we focus on the O's, turn it into a zero out of one. Know what I mean? <laughs> Honestly. But I'm getting that somebody wants to invest in you, Libra, okay? Someone sees you as a great investment or someone sees you as very loyal and practical and, you know, grounded, okay? Or you're winning big. Yeah, we have the Knight of Pentacles. So, yeah, something is coming in. So, it's definitely from, like, an Earth sign here. I think we're having a new moon in Taurus. Correct me if I'm wrong. And is Jupiter in Taurus right now? So, something about Taurian energy. For some of you, you could have Taurus in your 11th house as well. So, Mother Nature is, like, your best friend right now. So, you need to be connecting with nature. Also, you're, you you're going to find that your finances are going up. And you should be working with your hands or doing something creative. I'm getting a lot of cooking as well. You need to be cooking. Some of you, you could be a cook. Okay, but there's, like, um, some type of... Shmani is coming towards you. I feel like it's been taking a long time to come, but it's coming, darling. Or somebody owes you something. Or somebody is coming with a sincere apology, but they're like dragging their feet with the Nine of Pentacles. Maybe somebody's very methodical. They know that they need when they come towards you. Excuse me. It's like, it's just, it's not, you know, it's like, okay, I, I accept your apology, but, you know, I want to need a little bit, a little bit more. I mean, a little bit, just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Take them up and pull them down. Just a little bit. Who's um reading that I channel that in? I can't remember. Verse 50 cent. Just a little bit, okay? <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel like I'm speaking really fast, Libra, but... So I feel like someone needs to hurry up. Okay? Because I feel like you're not waiting around for... I don't feel like you're waiting. Okay? Because, you know, at the bottom of the deck is happily ever after. So whatever is going to happen here, it's going to happen in the right time with the temperance. Somebody also could just be thinking about the right time to apologize to you. But I feel like somebody wants to bring you a gift or they want to show you sincerely how much they appreciate you. I also feel like someone feels like you are solid. Okay? Maybe this person is going through a lot of drama with the drama queen right now. And that's why they're taking a long time to see something to you. But they're going to see something. All right, so what's the temperance, please, and thanks? What's the temperance, darling? Somebody really wants to apologize. We have the nicest of emotions. Could be a Pisces, could be any water sign for that matter. Well, this could be like just sweet, kind gestures. Again, you know, when I think about water, I think about currency and also money is currency and it's on top of the rich bitch. So I'm just getting an overflow of abundance, darling. I feel like you're being blessed by an angel right now or you are the blessing in somebody's life. Okay. Honestly. But somebody, but the overall energy is apology. So someone is apologizing. Somebody could be apologizing for fucking with your finances as well like maybe somebody was doing something or um i don't know what's going on here darling okay but i feel like somebody really wants to make something right okay please clarify the king of pentacles so it could be a taurus a capricorn or a virgo pisces cancer or a scorpio sagittarius is here heavy aquarius is here heavy but it could be any sign okay we have the king of one to the emperor of emotions emperor of passion sorry so yeah, Aries energy could be Leo or a Sag. I feel like someone is very passionate about you. There could be two different people. It could be a fire sign and an earth sign that wants to apologize to you. Or somebody is taking action after kind of like really thinking about what it is that they want to say. Because I feel like someone is really serious. Somebody brings gifts. Now there could be one person that is like solid and the other person, they're just very attracted to you. But they're just on some bullshit. Like, so maybe you have a decision between two different people. Or wait, what you want to accept. Also, I'm getting like somebody's coming with creativity and somebody's coming with the foundation in order to support that creative idea. Okay, so this could be the same person or this could be two different people apologizing on two different on two different occasions. Now, for example, this could be like a financial email coming in saying, oh, you know, I regret to inform you such and such. However, here is your compensation for this, that, and the third. Maybe you complained about something. And so you're getting, you know, a refund or some backdated money or some compensation or something. Somebody wants to apologize for something that they put you through that's affecting you culturally or financially. Okay. 
it could be a loving person as well. So like I said, it could be from two different places, two different entities, or it's one person wanting to take action. They're very attracted to you. Yeah, the hanged woman. So yeah, someone is really hanging about and thinking. I also, I feel like someone has really seen something from a different perspective. They want to restore something or they have been enlightened. So there's some type of delay. Somebody also wants to apologize. I'm getting somebody saying, oh, I'm sorry for the delay. Okay. I feel like you're very enlightening to someone, um, Libra. And maybe somebody is just coming into that realization. But someone is taking a long time. But I feel like that's what the apology is. Somebody's apologizing for taking a long time. Or apolog apologizing for taking a long time to recognize something. Or for giving you something that you deserve with the happy ever after card. Okay. But it's going to end really well. So just don't rush the process. Like allow something to come in when it's going to come in, Libra. It's being delayed for a reason. Or this person is held up for a reason. Okay. But, you know, once that Knight of Pentacles comes, they're not going nowhere. So don't worry about the Knight because, you know, the Knight of Cups and the Knight of Wands and everything, that's like an emotional, impulsive energy. So, you know, if they feel some type of way, they're off. But the Knight of Pentacles, you know, they take a long time to make a decision. And once they're coming, they're, they're here to stay, darling. Okay, so that's what the Knight is saying. And he's not on a horse. He's, like, presenting himself. And he's like, yeah, once I'm here, I'm, I'm hanging about, darling. You're not going to see me go nowhere, okay? honestly so let's just see well like i said you could have three different people wanting to apologize okay yeah reveal yourself wanting to come out so i feel like somebody's about to reveal themselves someone's about to be very vulnerable with you and you've got full of yourself at the bottom of the deck yeah i feel like you are full of yourself libra i feel like you're feeling yourself right now and i feel like you have every right to <laughs> i also feel like you're full of inspiration passion beauty creativity that cannot be denied, Libra. Okay, so let's pull an additional card, darling. So many cards. Okay, it says, I feel oh so tempted. It's oh so hard to resist. I'm fighting the urge, but I'm losing my grip. So somebody could be fighting the urge to apologize. But someone knows that you are their happiness or, or like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't really understand what's going on here. Somebody's like drawn to you they can't resist you libra or someone owes you something they're fighting the urge so someone is delaying this on purpose like if you're waiting for someone to get back to you they're being long on purpose i don't know why someone is fighting this though i feel oh so crazy oh so, oh so insane i keep repeating the cycle over and over again so this could be what somebody does maybe this is why they're apologizing because they know that they repeat the same patterns so somebody could be trying to break out of like a bad habit or maybe somebody um, has been doing something to you over and over and over again. And you're just like, why the fuck do you keep doing that? You know? I feel oh so lost, oh so confused. Which way do I go? Which path do I choose? So this is this, this other person. And I feel oh so mighty. I have oh so much power. But I must be careful as I may cause a tower. Yeah. I feel like your power is too much for someone, Libra. Okay, I feel like someone's a bit intimidated. Someone's a bit intimidated by karma. Hmm. So someone's a bit lost and confused right now. They don't really know where to go. So this is why I feel like someone's trying to get themselves together before they come towards you with this apology. But but the happy ever after, I feel like you're really happy. Like I said, I feel like your money or everything else is good. Um, if you're focused on like something cultural or social change or something, I feel like you're helping to change people's minds or you're helping to... You're helping people to see things from different perspectives. And I feel like you're making people feel very apologetic for how they have treated you. Okay. So, you know, the King of Wands, the King of Pentacles is coming towards you. And the Knights. There's Knights, there's Pentacles. So a bunch of men or masculine energy is very attracted to you right now. Okay. Okay. Or you could be dealing with a woman that's just got holds a lot of masculine energy, but I feel like your finances are being blessed. I feel like someone is just waiting for the perfect time to approach you, but just know you are very inspirational to someone, Libra, and someone really does owe you that apology. So thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed the reading. Please don't hesitate to comment, share, and subscribe. Bye.